Social media recently, you may have noticed women and men posting stories of sexual harassment or abuse accompanying the words, Me Too. It's part of a movement aimed at drawing attention to the number of people who've dealt with it. This comes in the light of growing allegations of sexual assault and harassment against Hollywood producer Harvey Weinstein. And today, we spoke with the executive director of Day One in Providence, an organization whose primary focus is on sexual assault. Peg Langhammer tells us one in four girls and one in six boys will be sexually abused before the age of 18. And one in five women will be sexually assaulted on a college campus. This is like a, this is a groundswell, you know, and I think the more people come forward, the more people will be believed. And that's, that's kind of what's happening with all of this locally as well as nationally. More than a half million people have posted the words Me Too on Twitter and Facebook just in the past few days. And new tonight, we're sitting down with State Representative Teresa Tanzi, who has been asked to chair a commission studying the issue of workplace harassment and assault. Iowa Sioux supporter Sheena Lashuto spoke with Representative Tanzi. She joins us now live from the State House with what she had to say. Now, Representative Teresa Tanzi says as a lawmaker, she felt like she must use her platform to speak up. She says she's already received dozens of messages thanking her for showing people that more people are sexually harassed than you might think. Like many others, the accusations against Hollywood producer Harvey Weinstein had State Representative Teresa Tanzi shocked. I um, was horrified. She chooses to join thousands of others in the Me Too movement, letting people know anyone can be a victim of sexual harassment, including herself. I have been in the workforce for three decades and that it has started with my very first job and continued um, to this day. But she has hoped that the number of people speaking up can make a difference. Personally, I think that this is, is something that um, we'll look at and definitively point to and say this is when the change began. And now moving forward, she's working with lawmakers to make a better environment for all. The Speaker of the House has asked her to chair a commission studying the issue of workplace harassment and assault. I found when it happened to me that it was incredibly difficult to find information about what I could do. And the information that I did find out was um, not very satisfactory. So I think that we have some room for improving the laws that are on the books for uh, people in Rhode Island. And Representative Tansy tells me that she encourages people to go on social media and read all the stories that come with the hashtag MeToo so that the conversation can continue. Reporting live in Providence tonight, I'm Sheena Loshudo, Eyewitness News.